Hello. And uh, good good uh, good afternoon, I think it is now. It's a bit subliminal. Oh, wrong cup. Wrong cup, never mind. First mistake I've made in ages. Ha <laughs> ha. You wally. Okay, just a quick one. A quick couple of minutes, that's all it is, right? It's just to let you know about a specific thing, the Royal Mint dot, dot news and the Royal Mint dot TV. Now, if you remember, I put Royal Mint dot TV domain name up for sale for a million pound and, you know, I intend to keep the pressure on as long as it takes. So one day, I do expect that they will want to buy it off me. If they don't, it will eventually get rather embarrassing. So... I can only see that there is one eventual outcome, which is that sooner or later they will want to buy the domain name. Anyway, that one was £100, remember? Now, we had 17 of you buy into that by the time things all went a bit funny. So there's 83 of those left for sale. And the other one, rawmint.news, was £39, if you remember. And we've sold 22 of those, so there are 78 of those left. And, um, and it's the same deal as before, in that whatever I sell it for, half of what I sell it for is divided up between the 100 shares. So those of you that bought two shares or four shares, you'll get two times or four times the money. Now, what I've decided to do is, I've decided to do it pro rata-ish. So the million pound, 100 pound a share, right? And then we've got um, £39 a share, but I'll put that up for 200 and some thousand. I'm going to change that. I'm going to put it up for something like half a million. And then if I do another one and I put it up for a quarter of a million, then I'll make it 25 quid a share and so on. And if it's half a million, I'll make it 50 quid a share. But I know that one was £39, but that's all right. So do you see what I'm saying? I'm going to do it like that. Now, where are they for sale in case you would like to buy one or two? Because the more of those you buy, the more it bloody well helps me out, I tell you. Certainly gives me a bit of cash now. Mind you, to preempt the question, if somebody says, but Ian, you owe me 25 quid, can I knock 25 quid off? Yes, you can. Ian, you owe me 100 pound, can I have a share? Yes, you can. It makes no difference to me, because again, paying the debts off with goods or money is immaterial. So those of you that want that, that's fine. I've not cashed any of those in, because I'm keeping that one going. Um, so, if you would like to buy it, if you would like to have a share, if you would like to have another share, um, if you would like to support us in that way, go to, please, please go to, www. the three W's and a dot, and then payhip.com forward slash Ian. That's P-A-Y-H-I-P. P-A-Y-H-I-P. Payhip.com forward slash, and then just Ian, I-A-N. And that will take you to my pay hip profile products page, whatever. And if you have a look on there, there are two listings with a photograph. on, And the photograph is like um, what you'd hang on a Christmas tree. Somebody did us a couple of photos. Somebody made those pictures for me. And do you know what? To my embarrassment, whoever that was, whichever one of you that was, I've totally forgotten who it is. And I'm so sorry because I should give you the credit for it. Please forgive me for that. And remind me, Ian, it was me. Um... So, uh, anyway, Christmas baubles. So, they're the ones you're looking for. One is priced at £39. One is priced at £100. You can pay by PayPal. And, uh, and that will be great. That will support us. And, uh, and any more that I do, I will put them up there. I don't think it's something that I can put on eBay, to be honest. And the reason I don't think it's something I can put on eBay is because, even though I think the donation one is okay... I think that one goes, I'm not too sure, I think it goes against their terms, membership and all the rest of it. I don't quite know how you would do that one on eBay and I don't want to fall foul. So I'm going to put them on PayHip. It's a lot easier. And you can go on there and I've set the quantity so that we can't get overloaded. I've got the file now. That's why I've done it, because I've now found the file. Um, and uh, for that one. And so I, can, I know exactly who's bought it and who hasn't and, uh, and I can add to it. And we had 22 of one and 17 of the other. So we still have some more of those for sale. So uh, if you still believe in that idea, because, you know, sooner or later, like I say, I make enough noise, they've got to get round the table one day. Whether I make that noise through a solicitor legally, whether I make that noise through 
social media, whatever. But if I make a big enough noise, they will have to get around the table. All right then, so you can go over to payhip.com forward slash Ian and you can uh, get another one of those shares, which will be great for me. Thank you very much. And great for you later on, I hope, because they are worth uh, an unbelievable amount of money if I'm right. If I'm wrong, it's a few quid, 100 quid, 39 quid that you've... It's a lot of money, I know, to throw away, but if I'm wrong, well, I guess, yeah. But then I'll always make good, because if I'm wrong at some point in the future, I will make good on that like I have done everything else. And you know that I will. All right, then. Thanks very much. I told you. It's just a quickie. Thanks a lot. Bye for now.